Alrighty, Tales of Arise part uh, 15. I think I said 13 last time when it was 14. It's 15 now. Uh, last time I got battered in a dungeon that was meant for someone uh, 20 or 30 levels higher than I am right now. Um, and uh, I went and cleaned up this whole area. Now I just need to run down the stair or the ladders for all of this and then hit the teleporter to teleport back to the start. And then I don't know what. <laughs> I have no idea. We'll figure it out together. <laughs> Let's do that. Uh, top left was fine for camera. Okay. Guess I misread the landing. No, that's fine. Oh! Oh no. Okay, we good. <laughs> Don't make me fight these guys. No! You're not fine. Ugh. Not fair. Smoke. Bow! Wait, why did it attack that one? There we go. Good start. Thank you for the help. Appreciate that. Multitasking while I take a drink. Yeah! No! Not fair. What a jerk. That sucks. We had it. We had it so hard. Oh well. Could have been worse. I agree. Ever so slightly, it could have been worse. I think I might be like super weak right now, maybe? I don't really remember all that well. Wanna go ahead and snag that again? Ugh. As soon as I recognize that teleport pad, I will hit it. Oh, nice. I didn't think I'd be able to sneak down that. Cool. Get me in there. Alrighty, righty. Hang on. Yo, what up? I wonder if these pebbles are good enough for justifying walking away, walking back in, and just claiming them over and over again. Probably not, right? In case it was, I guess. Thank you. Alrighty. I didn't fight those guys last time either. <laughs> no! That's fine. No further. Get him, bro! That's big! That attack is ridiculous. It's so good, though. Where am I? Oh! <laughs> How'd I get up there? I didn't even know that could happen. I I didn't. I thought something went like way wrong. Flames in my technique. We're stronger together than we are apart. All right. See, as I mentioned last time, I don't intend on changing my thought or my goal here. I'm going to be prioritizing the main stuff, pretty much entirely. Um, I don't really see much of a need to do anything other than that, so I'm just not going to. It just isn't worth it. God. And I would be at it for so long. Uh, guess I misread the landing. Man, where in the world? Oh, I didn't think it would let me sneak by like that. That's big. Where in the world was that teleporter I saw once upon a time? Hmm. Who's here?
That's a teleporter. And, uh, all right, I'm just leaving, right? Yeah. Yeah. I believe I'm just leaving. Hey, cool. Really could have just been a cutscene and just had me here, but I guess not. Sure. <laughs> Whatever. It looks like that beam of light has stopped. Then is it safe oh. to say we've avoided oblivion for the time being? I can still sense a faint glimmer of energy, though. It hasn't completely dispersed. You can tell? Rinwell, your senses seem a lot sharper than before, don't they? And you said you heard that voice, right? I guess. Maybe. I don't know. I don't feel bad, though. If trace amounts, however small, do remain, then it leaves us no choice. We must destroy the entire structure. What do you suggest? We bring it down piece by piece? Once Crash that done, boat into it. What do we do Sink then? the bad boy. <laughs> we go to Lenigus. <sighs> Even if we could destroy the whole wedge like he suggested, It'd only buy us time. The fact they sent this thing down tells me they're not giving up this planet without a fight. This has to be the point of no return. It's got to be. The matter of the has to be. Its circumstances still have yet to be truly resolved. But how do we even get to Lenigus? What if we hotwire one of their starships? There's got to be one on the planet somewhere, right? Starships are only seen on Dana at the start and end of the Crown Contest. Otherwise, they remain on Lenigus. Believe it or not, we Renans down here aren't quite as free to come and go as one might think. Great. Well, I'm out of ideas then. We definitely don't have the tech to build a starship. And even if we found a hmm. Renan who'd help, who knows how long that'd take. So, oh, I thought there would be some backlog or background audio. <clears throat> um, so we beat the guy. We we don't know what happened to him though. So he went back to Lanigus. Uh, we beat the guy, and then we got the core from him. We fused the cores together, and it was like, whoa, it's not working. What's happening? And then, uh, that lady, uh, who, in, the lady in red, who just kind of was hanging out with a bunch of different, um, a bunch of different, uh, Renan, uh, leaders, whatever they were called, I forget the name, um, lords, Renan lords, uh, she, uh, came in, opened her mouth, her eyes went wide and they were black, and she, uh, fucking sucked all of them up into herself. Uh, and, uh, happened to have an, an extra core that we didn't know about. And it was like, whoa, uh, <laughs> and that pushed on to the next act of the game. And I thought that they put it behind a paywall and I was really mad, but turns out they did not. Um, I just have a bit more left. Does the game want you to manually walk back to the starting area of the game? Uh, no, it is made me do something like that though yeah i did have to reconnect and then i was able to tra teleport freely and now i have a ton of side stuff to do and i can't tell which of that side stuff is over leveled because it doesn't tell me the recommended level at all so i just said forget it i'm done and now i'm just only doing the main story <laughs> i believe there's probably like five hours left six hours left i believe um so that's my play Oops. Yeah, waiting for a starship to come down from Lenigus would probably be quicker than that. Wait. If we all jump. Alfin, when you came down from Lenigus, it had to have been in a starship of your own, right? Right. Oh, of course. You can't be serious. That was 300 years ago. There's no way it's still gonna work. But Alfin didn't wake up until a few years ago. That means it had to have still been functioning that whole time to keep his body preserved. Indeed. You wouldn't happen to remember where you landed, would you? 
My memories around where I parked are still a little hazy, <laughs> but I do know that I woke up in Calaglia. So chances are it's still in the area. So now it is making me go this back to the start. To start. <laughs> Luckily, that realm's my old stomping ground. So I should be able to get us some help finding her. <sighs> We're gonna ask that old dying doctor to run around the whole the whole uh, village it. looking. Yeah. As long as Lenigus stands there, there's no avoiding it. So what's this help in Calaglia you're planning to enlist? My buddy Nath. If anyone there knows something, I figure it's him. But first, we need to catch a boat and get back to the mainland. Okie dokie. It's got to... The moment that I get to that, it has to be point of no return. It has to be. Our I don't see what else it could be. Back where you first started out. Yeah, along with my dad. <sighs> You okay? You don't look so good. Uh, I think I'm just a little seasick, that's all. Just a liar. Unbelievable out of her. Liar? Yep, see? Huh? You heard me. You've never been good at hiding your emotions, Xion. Called it. Excuse me? Can't believe just her. What do you. <sighs> no. You're right. I'm sorry. Is it about Alfin? No, not just him. Something you can't talk about? Renwell, I'm... I'm not like the rest of you. Of course you are! <sighs> no, I'm serious. Back when we first met, I think maybe then I did think we were different. But now I know that isn't true. You and I are the same, Xion. We're alike in more ways than you know. <laughs> if any of us is different, it's me. I'm a Danon who can use magic. I may be the last. My family and I have been living in hiding as long as I can remember. Bring about being more special. What a jerk. Everyone has their own pain that can be hard for other people to understand. I saw the two of you talking and thought you could use a third wheel. So, here I am. <laughs> Sorry. If anyone's the odd one out here, it's me. Believe me, you don't want to listen to my problems. Want me to go? I didn't say that. I get that you must have a lot circling around that head of yours. And that's okay. Ugh. Whatever's worrying you right now, you're allowed to worry about it. And you don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. I know I'm not a Renin like you, or a mage like Rinwell. I'm not a sovereign, maiden, or lord. I'm just a Danon who used to be a slave. But regardless of all that, I'm here for you, Xion. It's not how you spell her name. Spell it right. There's two N's, you jackass. That goes for me, too. We hey, Dagoth, all want how to be you doing? For you. Me and Hoodle and even the boys. I promise. I mean, that is what friends are supposed to do, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I imagine so, man. I said this to Alfin, and now I'll say it to you. You're not alone in this. Thank you. Renwell. Kisara. And right on cue, I think I should make my way back and lie down for a bit. <laughs> my battle right. with this ship continues. I forgot she gets seasick. <laughs> yeah, I better head back too. We wouldn't want the guys thinking they're in charge. Can you imagine Law at the helm? Who knows what kind of trouble we'd get into. He'd probably find a way to kill his dad again. I'm not letting it go. <laughs> it was way cooler. I hate that I could tell that he wasn't going to be a part of the game. It's very frustrating. Still. Yeah, he is. Agreed. If that's true, then it's all the more reason I have to do this. 
Well, that was bad. That was self-sacrificial. Okay, that's not good. I think it's safe to rest here now. What does that mean? What are you trying to do? Uh, all right. Something is definitely up with Xion. I don't think I have that as an option, dude. Yeah, something big by the looks of it. I've never seen her so serious. So, do you think we should say something to Alfin then? I was wondering the same thing myself. But then it occurred to me. Hmm? Whatever this thing on her mind is, sec. it's probably the last thing in the world she wants people to know about. <sighs> if she's trying this hard to keep it secret, then it's not really our place to go telling people before she's ready. Yeah. I can't tell them. There's... There's just no way I could, right? I... So she's <sighs> intending on sacrificing herself, huh? What? So how's that gonna work? Um, so when I was looking for mods uh, to throw into the game, I quickly realized that they're like 99% just costumes and stuff. The amount of mods, there were not that many nudie mods. They were there, but there weren't that many. Um, <laughs> but there were a few that were like stacked Shion, <sighs> stacked Kisara. They basically just went in and raised the size of their titties and ass by like by like 500%. And the videos for them are insane. Like, the the things they would have associated to it to be like, oh yeah, this is, this is what this is like, so you know what you're getting into, was crazy. I couldn't believe what I was looking at. It was... It was nuts. <laughs> for sure. For sure. There's no banging. But there, there were, uh, there were definitely mods that uh, added gigantic titties and ass, and there was also, uh, yeah, uh, full puss and nip mods. <laughs> Can't wait for everyone else to go back to medieval technology and a bunch of, a uh, bunch of tech. They lack the infrastructure to maintain them. Uh, physics breaking jiggling. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I don't know what this is about, yeah. but uh, I do that one. Okay. I sure hope that interview won't come back to bite me on the ass. We'll see. I wish I could get an examination. <sighs> well, if you say so. I bet I nailed that. All right. <sighs> okay. Let me see, uh, yes, you're in well, all right? If only your brain could keep up with your mouth. Oh, what a jerk. Laglia. Feels like it's been ages. Ugh. Everyone around here looks so much happier than they used to. They'd be a lot happier also, if they had their leader back feels alive. like an entirely different place. They stare at the wall. it's had time to adjust to its newfound freedom. Zephyr would have been so happy to see this. Yeah, he really would have. Especially if he knew law was... Law? <sighs> Something bothering you, Law? Nah, Does being surrounded by fine. all of your dad's just, friends and, and you know, loved ones make you sad for some reason? It weighs on you, doesn't it? I bet it does. Running away back then. Yeah, it should. I abandoned my home. Well, you're then a little I pussy boy. Come back, it's been liberated. Yep. What's important is that it's free. I get that, I do. I just... I don't want to hear from him. All right. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> uh, okay, what do we got? Ugh. Oh, Just this jackass. And it all falls on my head too. I hated this guy. Yo, what up? Hey, Nath. What? Can't you see I'm... Alfin? No, you're not. Looks like you have your hands full. As much as ever. As if I wasn't busy enough putting down the last remnants of Ren and Rule, I'm up to my ears and Dan in disputes. And then, to top it all off, 
That thing had to come Ugh. crashing down from out of the sky. Pretty sure we've heard this somewhere before. But enough about my problems. What can I help you with? Yeah, we're looking for an old Renan starship. You wouldn't happen to know any around these parts, would you? A starship? What do you need one of those for? To get to Lenigus. Oh, I didn't think I'd tell him Lenigus. that. Lenigus? <laughs> Are you out of your damn mind? I didn't think I'd... Okay. Believe it or not, it wouldn't be the craziest thing we've done recently. Well, I believe it. Well, either way, I'm afraid I haven't heard anything about a starship. Useless. Then do you have any historical records by chance? Sure, we've got stacks of old records. Mind if we take a look at them? Yeah, okay. Thanks, Nath. What was with that? Like, really long pause. I read through all of the <sighs> records, but I only found a single line that might point to what we're looking for. It mentions a rock that shot across the sky and landed past the mountains. The event was recorded just before the first Renan invasion. And you think that might be the starship? I don't know. There was nothing else in the records that came even close. It looked like it was someplace called Berg, but maybe I'm reading it wrong. Berg? That ring any bells for you? Yeah, that's one of the biggest volcanoes in Calaglia. I was just there recently, investigating a report of a meteor someone saw. Is that the... Another meteor in the same area? Really? I wonder if it could have been one of those mm. lights that shot out of the wedge. All the more hmm. reason to check it out. Can you tell us how to get there? The old Zion mine is up that way. One of the veins we abandoned connects to the volcano. Go ahead and use that, but you I, should be careful. I think... <sighs> I don't know if it has anything to do with the meteor. There's a giant zoogle running riot in there. A zoogle, huh? Well, I turned back as soon as I caught sight of the thing, so I can't tell you much more. Just be real careful if you head out that way. So, is that the, mm. like, castle that was broken down and whatnot? <laughs> Alright, I don't care about these guys. Hmm. <laughs> no. He's talking about I Zephyr's didn't like kid. The sound of that monster Nath was talking about one bit. Alright, what do we got? <laughs> Everything okay with Hoodle, Renwell? He seems kind of out of spirits. What's wrong with the owl? It must be the heat getting to him. We don't get these kind of temperatures back in Cislodia. Galaglians born and raised here struggle with it too, so it's no surprise. Aha! So that's why his plumage is so white. He was born in a winter wonderland. Actually, Dan and owls absorb the astral energy of whatever land they're raised in. Where they're born doesn't affect their appearance at all. But that's not why he's white. The real reason is that he's still just a baby. You mean their plumage changes color depending on where they grow up? Weird. And with all this traveling we've been doing, it wouldn't surprise me if his wings ended up looking like a colorful painting. I think he suits his snowy complexion. Dude, that'd be kind of cool, though. See him change. <laughs> I'd like to see How it. How awesome would it be if his head and wings were different colors, and his stomach and sides like a map of our travels? <laughs> I think I'd be Leo. badass. So what do you mean? Making him docile. You've only yourself to blame for that one. Hoodle takes pride in his appearance, you know. Fascinating. An appreciation of aesthetic beauty in an owlet so young. <laughs> Dohalim, I think you've drawn his attention. Sorry, I'm just checking something. I meant to look at it yesterday. I can't help but feel like something is going on with my capture again. I wonder if it has something to do with full screen applications. Because, um, let me go to when I was running around here earlier. This is a really dumb problem to have. Um, hopefully I'm just, I'm blowing smoke. Uh, but... I mean, parts of me running around here look... Fine.
Looks okay. And then over here, I was like hard locked. I can't tell. I can't tell. Ugh. I've been contemplating having to move back to, uh, like, single machine stuff again, uh, which is not very cool. Uh, so yeah, the mine tunnels, okay, cool. Alright, okay. Alright, here, and then just go to the east. Yeah, basically it feels great on here but as i run around uh or as like the footage is capped it seems like it's having some sort of jittery thing <sighs> which would be very annoying it's quite hot here the climate really hard to tell see us. it's gotten much cooler like that was all it's fantastic does that mean eyes were burning holes in us i don't feel like there's anything wrong with this at all it feels great. Yeah, this feels fantastic. But it's very possible that playback will be really bad. I'm going to clip that. Something feels odd here. For be later. Guard. Going to cut that. Going to put that right there. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to look at that again. Hmm. Anywho, new area. The hell was that? <laughs> so we're back in the Zion Mine Tunnels. Who would have thought we'd be going through this place again? This is where you and I first fought together. And also the first time we touched, as I recall. Wait, really? Yes, really. I don't remember. <laughs> I don't really remember. That was a while ago. I ain't got a good memory. <laughs> Unfortunately for me. Ugh. Oh, whoops it daisy I can avoid a bit of that, so let's do exactly that while I can. Uh... Oh. Oh, uh, whoops. <laughs> so wait, where does it? Oh. Okay. How did I miss that? <laughs> uh, huh. I guess it did vaguely look like nothing. So this path is supposed know. to take us out to Berg Volcano? We're not going to see any lava burst out in front of us or anything. Do, are we? Do. Don't get so paranoid you let a rock fall do, on your head, Law. Do, do. All right. Okay, yeah, that whole sequence was perfect too. So if that is like jittery on capture, then yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Oh boy, a lot of fire stuff. I mean, it's a volcano, so yeah. Okay. So hot. Yep. Well, yeah, we've reached the inner portion of Berg Volcano. So, we okay. need to find that starship and fast. Just like last time, I'm going to try to. Okay. I'm gonna try to avoid combat when possible. If it isn't gonna happen, I'm not gonna like force it. We'll have to just kind of see. Really? There we go. Alright. Okay. Oh god. 
Cool. I hadn't realized that was happening. That was not close. And a little bit of... Oh, there it is. Cool. Wow. Look what I just found. Alright. Well, that was probably good to do. Um, these are probably not cool. Hmm. I would like to avoid needless con- fuck, needless combat when needed. Or when I can. Oh, these guys. Oh, Lord. Ugh. That do it. I don't think it did. Bam! Come on! Oh, my God. Dash away. Nail that. That's big. This is good. They're good. Oh, hell yeah. That's great. Big fan. All right, and then... Okay. That worked out great. Worked out great. Okay. Will that be enough to do anything of value? Okay. Cool. 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 Well, that's good. I need to be stronger. Alrighty. Now, what does that gothic dress? Wait a second. I think. I thought that was the quiet dress. I thought that was the quiet dress. It was not. Also, I used up like a bunch of magic. Good God. That was so much magic. Why was that so much magic? <laughs> Christ. Uh, okay, so I don't think I care about those guys. Huh. So he is going to what? Grow the... Okay. You can make plants grow instantly? <laughs> what if we use this for fruits and vegetables? I'd rather not be our party's fertilizer. Thank you very much. Why not? That's a that's a pretty big thing to do. Okay. Well, that wasn't cool. What the hell? Oh my god. Ugh. Jesus. Let that land something? Oh, that didn't work very well. Oh my god. Thank oh come on. Let that be enough. It wasn't. Sure. Okay. Okay. Huh. Really? Come on. Oh my god. Please let something happen here. And, uh... Hey. Hell yeah. I'm reaching my cool. Limit, you guys. cool, cool, cool. Damn. Guess we better be extra careful. Avoid combat when I don't need to do it. My throat feels super parched. Alright. Here, have some water. Just make sure you don't drink too much. Thanks. I 
I'm not entirely sure they needed to do the. You want some <laughs> but all right. You're hungry more than anything, aren't you? That's I'm messed fine, up. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you. Which way do I need to go? So, back this way is just an excuse to open a path. And I don't have enough magic. Oh no, I do have enough magic. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm very glad you got your new glasses. <laughs> Uh, it sounds like you were in desperate need of those. Alright. I don't know if what, uh, whatever the item here is gonna be is going to be worth it, but we'll see. Shit. I got that wrong. Oh my god. Come on! That didn't work the way I wanted it to! Didn't work the way I wanted it to. Oh my god. No! No, I just left. That thing uh, turned out to be 30 levels higher than I was. I was 35. It was it was 65. If you have like a really good build, you can kind of do it, but I don't. So no. I did not. I did not, and I stopped even doing side quests. Oh my god! Okay. Oh. Uh, I'm being charged up by that guy. No. No, it's extra stuff they added to give you a reason to keep playing once you beat it. I think. And probably to get, like, really good items. <sighs> but that doesn't matter. <sighs> but that doesn't matter. I've used a bit too much healing. Yeah, we'll be okay. Uh, is that for me? No. Ooh, that's a big jump. Sure. I am glad I went and got it. Uh, okay, I'm gonna need more magic. In a few. Yeah, if it was required story-wise, I would, I would do it. But it, uh, it is not, thankfully. Oh, I should have gotten more of. I should have spent more or spent some money. Made a bit of a mistake. All this right. Will hold itself together, right? Most definitely. Ooh, a new cloak for surely you. Which is a pretty good jump Though up to. Sick. Which one is it? Don't need to fight those guys. They don't matter. Alright, cool. I'm also avoiding combat with things I don't need to fight. <laughs> I'm in that kind of phase of the uh, of the game. I didn't need to fight this, but I got caught. <laughs> and then I had to. Jesus. There it is. That was close. I was worried about that. Cool. Hell yeah. That was great. Ow. There it is. 
No problemo. All that for 8,800 gold. That's not really all that worth it, in all honesty. Uh, okay, I'll go to there uh, that in a sec. Alrighty. Let's see what we got. Oh my god! Get out of there! Yo! Yo! What's happening? Oh god! Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Alrighty, good lord. Uh, will this tag anyone extra or no? Think it got a few? I don't know. The hell? What was it targeting there? That was weird. Looking good. Don't let that asshole do anything. Cool. Alright. Was this... Oh, it's... Okay, okay. That was worth it. Those are cool. Uh, yep. And, uh, I guess to you? Makes sense. Maybe I should have gone to Elephant, but whatever. It's only 10. It's not that big of a deal. Still good, though. Still good. Perma buff. So, yeah. Kind of makes sense. Uh, okay. Oh, thank you. Okay, cool. The spot or diagrammed them. That's great. Let's see if I can sneak by. Fuck. <laughs> Not fair. Not fair. All right. And tag the two of them again. Oh my god. Something had a uh, guaranteed kill on it, and I don't know what it was. You should not have more faith in him. That's a bad idea. Nice. A little bit more. No. She better not break my thing. I'm working a combo over here. Hell yeah. Oh, that's not fair! I didn't realize! Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid. That was quite dumb. Quite, quite, quite dumb. I don't need that stuff that badly. Uh, yep, let's just go down here. Which I shall do. Watch where you're going, everyone. If you fall, there'll be nothing left of you. Exactly. So do Whoop. This better be worth it. It's just gonna be the costume or the uh, sort of trick up same costume for one of those guys. Probably Doha. Uh, I don't know who's that no, one's for. We'll see. We'll see. So what do you lead to? You lead to a path to go back into there. Oh, to. Okay. You can use that to skip stuff. Sure. Am I gonna regret that? Uh, I don't know. I don't care. 
<laughs> I don't know, and I don't care. It's fine. End game, I see. Probably. Big volcano. Feels like a uh, end of the thing type thing. <laughs> Unless you're referring to what Votion said, in which case, yeah, that's end game. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. All right, so this is gonna be big bad boss. This is gonna be big bad boss. Uh, actually, I should do. Oh, oh, that's a major increase. I got two pieces of armor for him this uh, this time. Odd, strange. Alrighty, let's smoke some ass. Come on, baby. What do we got? What do we got? Who's getting clapped? Is it that asshole from before? Nope. I think it's the main boss from Dante's Inferno. We have to watch out, his dick's gonna be visible. Probably that monster Nath warned us about, if I had to guess. Do you think this might have been where Jesus. one of those lights that shot out of the wedge landed? But why this location, if the purpose of the Wedge is to harvest Dana's astral energy? We can figure that out later. If that thing gets into town, it's going to cause chaos. We need to take it down and move on. Let's go! Oh, Lord. This one's tough, but we have no choice. Let me know if you need healing. Okay, so... How in the focus on your toes, everyone. What to do? What did it do? turning tail doesn't seem so ridiculous. What did it do? Me? <laughs> Are you? Do you even have to ask? Of course, I'm oh no. Focus up oh no. That thing's lunch. It's summoning Zoogle. That's not fair. Take care of them while keeping an eye on it. Okay, so similar design philosophy to the uh. To the uh, the dungeon, funny enough, they're somewhat similar. Come on, yeah! Oh, what happened? Yo! You shouldn't stand there. Dang it. Oh my god. <laughs> Whoo! Oh god. Dude, my damage output is not good. <laughs> ah! Jesus. Oh my god. Why is this one so crazy strong? What the hell? Looks like you came to my rescue again. Get him both! You didn't! Not fair. Good lord. It's gonna work. I have to watch out before I get tagged up by that thing. Dude, this damage is fucked. What is happening? Ow. Oh my god. <sighs> oh no. Just. Uh, yeah, I probably dropped him. I dropped him, bro. That's big. <laughs> I was stroking out a tad talking, but I got him back. Is the important thing. Oh my god. Jesus. Dude, these guys are getting fucking clapped. Please let this kill. Or do that, I guess, is also fine. There we go. 
<sighs> Alright. Now we can, uh, we can tag team the, uh, remaining guy. Camera, Jesus. What's happening here? Get out. Oh my god. Good lord. Come on already. Oh my god. I was not trying to do that. Holy shit. That was fucked. There we go. Okay. So now, what do you do? You spawn more? Ow. Yo! Yo! Uh, oh god. Ooh, this is bad. Yo! What the fuck? Woo! Jesus! 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 Good lord! Oh! Oh! Ow! Let that pop everybody, Jesus. Good lord, what a mess, man. Jesus. Whew. Uh, almost. Almost. Get out of there. Oh, they're dead. Oh my god. Uh, let me go ahead and, um... Let's pop that. Come on. Come on. Just about. Alright, thank god. Man, he's got a lot of spawning faces. Oh, God. Ow. So these sucked when we didn't have a bunch of assholes to deal with. Good Lord. Well, that's bad. Oh, God. Oh my god. Jesus. Uh, oh god. Please do something. You didn't do much. Man, they're all about to be a problem. Not fair. Not fair. Knock it off. Good lord. Oh my god. Oh, uh, what happened to the team? What the fuck happened to the team? Uh... Oh boy! Jesus! Christ! I don't know what just happened. Shion, you need to not die. You need to not die. I need you to not die. Uh, this is insane. Why is this so insane? What in the fuck? <laughs> this camera is driving me mad too. How about this? Oh god! Oh god! Ooh. Okay. Man, he's got so much. 
fucking hell. These things are fucked. Whoo! What was that? Ah! Ow! Where did you come from? Alright. Okay, yeah, we good. Oh boy. Uh, oh my god. Ooh. Please let this be enough. Oh. Please don't heal anymore. We need your reviving capabilities. I don't have any way to do that. Holy shit. How is this even happening? Jesus. Uh, please don't hit me. Please, God, let Law get Yella out of there. Okay. Yeah, man. Just keep going. <laughs> Just keep going. How are you still alive? Look at how many times I'm doing big, cool attacks to you. Knock it off already. It's camera. Whew. She's out of magic. I haven't done a single tick of damage to this big guy either. It's very frustrating. Okay, so when do I attack you? It's about to strike. Look sharp, everyone. Everyone else. What the fuck just happened? What the fuck right? just we happened? Soon. We won't retreat, not yet. Whatever you do, just what was Please that? <sighs> I am so fucked. How are we supposed to take on something so big? I agree. Just watch and learn. Nailed it. That's, That's all me. I might have wasted my villain. Go back down. Is that enough? Oh, defeat him. What? I wasted that thing, by the way, for sure. That's a shame. Although there was like no way to know that. What? <laughs> How in the hell? Dude, that's sick. <sighs> Everyone okay? Oh. Yeah, I think so. Everyone okay after I wasted a bunch of stuff at the that end? Thing scared the pants off me. It felt like it had a different aura than other Zoogles, didn't it? Yeah. It wasn't like the one that all made you <sighs> sick on us either. Its elemental astral energy variance was out of this world. It was She's like fighting a lord. About? I guess it's safe to assume that if it came out of the wedge, it must have played some part in helping harvest astral energy. But what? Perhaps a living spirit vessel? It's plausible, given the location. Or it may be part of a new force dispatched to regain control of Dana. If we assume that monster was one of the four beams of light, we must have prevented something from taking place here. I'd like to think so, knowing how much grief it gave us. But at least with that out of the way, we can keep moving forward now. Let's go. Okie dokie. Sweet. Uh, increased evasion distance. Uh, that, I don't really like to do that much. Uh, sure. Uh, whoops. Okay. Oh my god. Um, let's finish that. Get you that thing. And then, um, uh, I guess I'll just wait for the others. I need to pee, by the way. KO prevention will be great. I actually quite badly need that. Uh, sure. Don't think that is necessary if you're not actively playing the character, which I would not be. And, uh, sure. And I guess just to get it. Okay. Oh, secret key. Cool. Wow. And then I guess it's just go to the end. Tremendously. The speed and 
and precision of your all right. is simply unmatched. I will be. I had no idea oh. you were watching me so closely. My monitor shut off. <laughs> Full screen applications. Uh why is that a thing? Well, good to know that didn't fix. So I was right to call. I'll do one quick second. I need to pee. Okay, let's get up there. Let's get it. So where am I now? Okay, interesting. I guess I should rest hey, as soon as I get here. Oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> yes it is. Uh, okay, well let me um, manage my ranch, sure. Thank you. Send Rapig. That, that, send that. Didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. Uh, great, have fun, sell some stuff. Why don't I go ahead and sell some gold chunks? And why don't I go ahead and buy some, uh, that. Cool. Okay, cool. Huh. Uh, some of that is just good to have. Okay. And, um, transfer skill. So I can, what was the, kind of interesting. So enhance, no, so craft. Uh, oh, I don't have enough for that. Uh, let's do uh, that, I guess. But then I lose the attack bonus. Um. Let me see if I can understand how this works. That cost all my money. Enhance it. Uh, what if I transfer it? So... Oh. Oh. Well, I wasted stuff. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, yep. Uh, I can't afford any of the other stuff. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, some of those get way higher. And I will not have access to that. <laughs> because I just blew a bunch of my money. But that's okay. <laughs> I forgot about all that as a mechanic. 
entirely. I'm glad it was helpful, I suppose. Hey, look. We've got way more am I don't care about the animals. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Alvin? Did you remember something? No, but... I have seen this starship before. This is it. This is the ship I traveled in when I escaped from Lenegas. Three centuries later, and it's no worse for wear. I'll take a look at the internals. Damn! I'm amazed it still works at all after all this time. See the jacket and take off? The past meets the present. Those are just sat here for 300 years. I really am from a different time and place. Yeah, but you've got us now, Alfin. Not only that, but you've helped out so many people, too. Law's right. Rinwell, too. You're one of us now. No more carrying the weight of history on your shoulders. You're a part of this world. Right. Thanks, you guys. How's it look? It should fly. All internal systems seem to be operating. However, considering how long it's remained inactive, I suspect it will take some time before it's ready for takeoff. How much time are we talking here? Starship mechanics are not what I'd call my forte. So I'd rather not hazard a guess. So we've just got to sit around here and wait? I'm terrible at waiting. That's because you're a child. Oh, but how about we use this time to prepare and gather supplies for the trip? Good idea. Shit. Who knows when we'll be back from Lenegas once we leave. We should prepare ourselves for every possible scenario before we go. So that's that point Let's in our return I talked about. Long. I'd hate for anything to happen to the place while we're gone. Either we race ahead, or we take due precaution to ensure we have no regrets. I shall leave it up <coughs> to you as to how we proceed, Alfin. <coughs> Fuck. Works for me. <coughs> Jesus. What is she <coughs> angling to do, dude? Okay, wait until the ship is ready for takeoff. So. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, so first things first, I want to quickly initiate an upload of something. So give me a moment while I do that on the side here. Um, hopefully I'll be fine. So. Going into this. will just generally take time. And it wants me to do side questing. Probably. But I don't want to do side it's questing. Funny, I want to get it? into it. So I'll push. What is? All this. When we first started this thing, did you ever imagine we'd be going to Lenegas? After all, this is the sort of thing I was rebelling against when I ran away from home, right? I'm sure Zephyr would be proud if he knew what his son was doing right now. And a little shocked, too. We're defying the order of things that have persisted for 300 years. <laughs> Deep down, I knew our journey would lead to confronting Lenegas. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, you may be, but you're <clears throat> a Renan. The rest of us can barely even picture what it means to leave Dana. No offense to Shion and Dohalim, but it's worth remembering we're heading into enemy territory. No offense taken, and this is no picnic for me either. Remember. Our aim is to ensure that both Lenegas and the Renan homeworld leave Dana alone for good. I don't think we'll be able to avoid a fight. Is there no way we can talk them into leaving us alone? The people of Lenegas? Sure. Uh... I mean, we found a way to make it work with Shion and Dohalim, right? Probably not gonna happen, bro. And it's not just us. If places like Menensia can do it, 
Then why can't because we? Because there are still many of my kind who believe it was right and natural that Rena reigns over Dana. There are those on Lenigus who have never stepped foot on Dana. I doubt whether they'd even listen to Danans. Look, none of us want to fight. But these are the same people who fired that wedge down on Dana. What happens next is on them. Right. We're not going to sit back and wait for them to oppress us again. Right. Don't forget, there's also a good chance the Red Woman is somewhere on Lenigus. Final Fantasy is for weeps. What do you is, mean? We should find the Renaissance hey, too. Yeah, Final Fantasy That's already right. is this. How dare we can take it back? Then Xion can finally get rid of her thorns. <sighs> Xion? What is she planning? What are you planning? Uh, uh yeah. Damn it, Xion, what are you doing? Ah, Hmm. Well, it's very weeby. Oh. She dipped. I didn't see her in that. Where? Shion? Dude, if the ship is just gone. Oh. My. God. Okay, never mind. Okay, okay. I was about to Where freak out. Where did Shion go? How could she just go off on her own? Where did Shion go? It was like five steps away. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Ugh. Shion. Shion! It's your thorns? But why? <laughs> you okay? Just now, I looked like you used your maiden powers to suppress your thorns. You can really do that? <laughs> Stay out of my way. Wait a second. Are you planning to go alone? Shut up! Why would you do this? I told you to shut up! I won't let you. I mean it. I refuse to let you. I won't tell you again. Move or I'll shoot. I've been shot a lot. I can probably tank it. Then go ahead and shoot me! Dude, if any of them wake up and they just have to, like, kind of pretend that they're asleep so they don't catch the smoke, too. Do you remember back when I was stabbed by Rolron? Yes. Yeah. For a second, no. I thought for sure that he had killed you back there. <laughs> that wasn't the first time. Huh? The first time was when I was only a child. After that, no matter how often, I just couldn't die. Couldn't die? I never finished that. So you're immortal? That one. How's that even... <clears throat> I believe you, Xion. Tell me how... How is something like that possible? My thorns. They're me, but at the same time, not. They're part of me. I have no idea why. But my thorns will never let me die. At least not before I'm meant to. You can't die before your death? When my thorns free themselves, it will be my death. <laughs> I've seen it. 
A darkness that swallows up everything until nothing remains. Oh shit. It's a vision of oblivion I can't escape. Oh, I forgot that. I want to uh, believe it's all happened. just a bad dream. Sure would suck. But no matter what I tell myself, I I know it's not. Yeah, but you wait. The whole reason you you needed the Renaissance was to get rid of your thorns, right? If I burn away what's inside, then what will happen to the rest of me? Right. Either way you look at it, I'm going to die. But if I am going to die, I figure I can at least take my thorns out with me. That's what I've been after this whole time. You fucking asshole, dude. That's why you turned your back on your fellow Renans and chose to fight with us, isn't it? And while we've all been fighting to keep on living, you have been with us fighting desperately to die. That was the plan. But then I met all of you. And I... Before I knew it, I didn't want to die anymore. Shion, don't lose hope yet. We'll find a way to save you. There's still time to. It's pointless. Why? Because the darkness won't just consume me. The truth is, it will consume all of existence as well. It was only a suspicion at first, but ever since the Red Woman triggered my maiden powers, I've been more certain than ever before. It was then that I finally came to realize my powers were holding my thorns in check the entire time. But they don't anymore. Not since Lenigus, when the wedge fell. Every day, I feel the thorn's power growing stronger inside of me. Pretty soon, I won't be able to hold them back anymore. And when that happens... They will consume all existence. <sighs> and that's why you wanted to leave by yourself. You planned to find the Renesalma on your own and sacrifice yourself to stop the thorns. But that's... It's way too much. So what is the outcome going to be instead then? I didn't care what happened to me or anyone else. And what happened to the Renans or the Danans didn't matter to me at all. I know I have to die. But I don't want to. Not now that I have this. I wish we had never met. Then I wouldn't have to feel this way. That was actually a well acted God. scene. Ugh. It's no better than being a slave. How can you endure this? Elfin. It's not fair. I don't care what anybody says. I won't let it happen. We can fight this. We'll fight until the end together. Isn't that what you said to me before? Even if it should mean that it'll be the end of everything else, too? Xion, what do you want? It's your decision, ultimately. The whole time this is happening, he's just muttering little ow, ow, fuck, ow. Even if I have to do it alone. No, you won't be alone. Ugh. I'll fight as well. Ugh. Count me in as well. I want to be a force for good, not hate. And me too. 
I meant it with all of my heart when I told you before. Neither of you are alone in this at all. You guys... And I, for one, don't believe this venture is without hope. Huh? Shion is the descendant of a maiden from 300 years ago. Given the circumstances, it seems very likely that those events have some connection to Earth. No, not the song! No! <laughs> nature of which, I imagine <laughs> no, not that song! And uncover the truth no, the it's gonna <laughs> take away all my monetization and block the video again. Stop it! <laughs> take that song off! <laughs> Though I suspect no! Sovereign is connected somehow. Stop it! So be it. Fuck! <laughs> I've already lost everything I had once. Maybe me and them talking over it, and I won't let it happen again. will be enough. Shion. No matter what happens from now on, we're right here with you. All of us are. You are not alone. Nope, that's too much. That's too much. That'll be too much for it. I have to interrupt it. <laughs> I have to interrupt this tender moment so YouTube don't smoke me and I don't get muted on Twitch or any of that. <laughs> You're all so stubborn. Talking through, talking through, talking through, talking through. Actually, I can just do this. Fascinating. So is there going to be any way to work around that, or is it just going to be the rap is fucking she goes? Interesting, interesting, interesting. So this 1000% leads into the uh, the point of no return. Um, no shadow of a doubt uh, in my mind for that. Um... So, I will, uh, I will have to be prepared as much as I'm going to be. I don't think I'm going to change anything, though, in all honesty. I'm going to do these pieces of dialogue and then get to the point of, okay, uh, if you continue, this is now it. I don't know how long that will be. It could be a while. I don't know. But I'm going to do this chatter here and then probably wrap after I do chatter from... Everybody other than Shion, I bet. It's hard to believe, isn't it? I believe Shion is telling the truth. What about you? As a friend, yes. I want to believe her. Everything that's happened seems to point towards some sort of great danger that's lurking ahead of us. Still, it's hard to fathom uh. something that could usher outright doom to the world. That those really are the stakes we face. No, I understand. Even Shion doesn't seem to know exactly what will happen to bring it all about. We have so many pieces of the puzzle in our hands, so many clues, yet the complete picture eludes us. So where do her thorns fit in, then? Well, I imagine they must sit at the very center of it all. You remember the voice we all heard while we were inside the wedge, don't you? Yeah, I remember. It was the will of Dana's astral energy come to life. Or well, that's what we all thought. Right. And from that, we're able to hypothesize how vast concentrations of astral energy can become sentient. Let's return to when we found Shion in Pelegion. When her thorns went wild, they contained far more astral energy than any mere Renin would normally have inside them. So you think those thorns might be alive too? That their will is what keeps her from dying? But why would they want to destroy the entire world? Yeah, I don't... That, that part's wacky. I really cannot say for certain. <laughs> <laughs> its goals still remain oh, a mystery. Shit. Sorry, I'm, I got sidetracked. Maybe a mere fluke that her maiden powers have been able to contain it thus far. Let's finish this up. You know, I've noticed since we've met that you like figuring out riddles. Can you blame me? 
When one realizes that the world they once thought to be true is but a mere facade, they just like... they can't help but seek the truth. Especially when that deception has led to others getting hurt. To Halim? I imagine the remaining pieces of the puzzle that we seek rest somewhere within Lenigus. As for what the final picture will look like, who can say? Right. So, for the boys, I uh, forgot about it. Totally forgot. Completely forgot. A thousand percent. Just forgot. Uh, first episode of Archer that I watched. Our first few episodes of Archer's uh, last season. Great so far. Uh, although it does definitely follow the same pattern as the last season. Or the, the 13th season, I guess. Um, in, in terms of... Uh, it isn't as well done. It's hard to explain. Basically, it it has this kind of like rushing problem to it. Um, it still is good, and there's a lot of good sections and a, a lot of good like a lot of good uh, 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 co comedy and and just general I don't know quality I suppose. But it, it it's it's paced poorly. They're kind of like rushing to it. It's almost like every episode needs an extra ten minutes or something. Uh, I'm four i think four in um of the i'm four in of the like nine total episodes and episode nine is three episodes smashed together so that kind of screams to me that it's also going to be like a rushed thing um archer uh peak was like i don't really remember it very clearly but first season to like the 10th uh it started to kind of have this pacing problem still is very funny still is very well done still has a lot of good stuff with it and I, I i giggle and laugh at a lot of it um but it's hard to deny some weird shit uh with it i guess but it's good so far i'm very happy to be watching it and uh i am fucking annoyed because i read that basically it got cold cancelled so I think what's going to happen is it's going to, they tried to like wrap, I think what's going to happen is they tried to wrap everything up and get it to a good closing point and thought they'd get like a final couple episodes thing to do. But then they ended up having to do three episodes as one for their final episode and then didn't get any other uh, stuff. So I don't know if it's going to be conclusive. I kind of have a sad sneaking suspicion that it won't work. Did they go underwater or something? Uh, why? I don't know the I don't know the joke, the bit, or whatever. I missed it. Why? Why? Who me? Yes, you. You took a hit from those thorns again, didn't you? I'm walking with a limp, but you know. That was nothing. Compared to what Shion's going through, you mean? Still, even if you yourself might be willing to endure that kind of pain, at some point, yeah. That doesn't mean Shion wants to have to see you get hurt by her thorns, you know. I don't remember if it's yeah. the first or not. I don't think I'll so. Be careful. Shion doesn't know how lucky she is to have you around, you know? Dashing in to save her at the last minute. Yeah, yeah, very funny. I'm being serious. You went up and held her close like you still had that mask on, and you didn't even bat an eye. <sighs> she really needed that. That's what I mean when I said you saved her, just like you did with the rest of us. Great show, though. I just want for Shion what we all have, the ability to touch someone without the fear of killing them. Those thorns have robbed her of the kind of everyday things we all take for granted. And it's not right. You can say that again. It may be normal for us, but that doesn't make it any less special or important for her. I have my own dreams. But a world without her, where she dies so we can all survive, isn't a world I want to live in. Agreed. It's like more and more keeps getting taken from her, and I'm done with it. Can't sleep. After everything we just heard, how could I? Fair enough. Shion's had to deal with so much on her own. Even when we were all laughing and celebrating, she just kept quiet and didn't say anything. I thought she was keeping her distance because of her thorns. That it was because she didn't want to hurt anybody by getting too close. I just figured that that was the type of person she was, you know? But it turned out to be none of that. All this time, she felt like she had to die and sacrifice herself for the greater good. But even then, she didn't think she could say anything to us about it. I know. 
She was so alone this entire time. How could I call her a friend and yet be so completely blind to everything she was going through? How would you know? I'm sure it made her happy, knowing you were there for her. You really think so? Yeah, I do. If she didn't think of us as friends, I don't think she could have ever opened up to us like that. You were a good friend to her before, and you'll be an even better one now. Yeah, I really hope so. When you think about it, we were all alone in our own way. But over time, we've all found ways to let each other into our lives. I hope Xion's able to do that one day, too. No, I mean, I hope she's able to do that more. Lots and lots more. I think it'd be really nice if we could all just be there to support each other when it really counts. I thought you were about to say, like, and there's a camera or something. I didn't know what... <laughs> The way that was was paced out, or spaced out, I guess, uh, concerned me. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. They can be kind of cool. Home assistants like that are neat. Um, oh, one of those guys. Oh, okay. They're neat. Forget about our grudges and pain. I have a tough time skipping out on the privacy concerns and such, but you know. All right. Did you know? Fuck that guy. Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck that guy. Alright. Ugh. Tuh. I don't like that. That's gross. <laughs> hey, you doing alright? Alright, final cutscene will do. <laughs> I seem to cause nothing but worry. As Ugh. much as I try to look like I have things under control. Everyone still worries about me. You're not the only one. Hey, do you remember the first time you said I was your friend? <sighs> no. When was that? Sorry, I can't remember. That's okay. It came so naturally to you, I'm not surprised you forgot. I was different back then. The Danans were not even people to me, and I knew I would always be alone. But in that room with Deadheim, when you called me your friend, it just shattered the wall that I'd built up around me. Because until that moment, I don't remember that scene that I'd well. I've seen you as a means to an end. I thought of you as a way to use the Blazing Sword, and to obtain the Renis Alma. <laughs> but after that day, one time became two, and before I knew it, you'd made a habit of calling me and Dohalim your friends. It didn't matter that we were Renans. You cared about us as you would any other people. What? So you haven't finished the first eight episodes before the three-episode conclusion for C N no No. <laughs> No, I, I have... No, I, I was starting season 14. I didn't have season 14 at all. I didn't watch that at all. I'm four episodes into that. Did I say it? Did I fuck up? Did I say it kind of awkward? Or did it, Oh, was it just not known that I didn't... Yeah, no, I didn't watch uh, the whole of season 14. I'm four episodes into season 14. Which is eight main episodes, and then episode nine is three of them smashed together, and I don't think they're going to be conclusive is my concern. Then, everyone else started to call me their friend too. To think of me as their friend. Before then, I never even dreamed I could have that. I did peace so badly. I didn't want to die and lose you all. But I also didn't want to live if it meant you would all die in my place. Xion. But then, I realized... I'd only really been thinking of myself that entire time. After saying how I felt... ...and hearing what you all had to say... ...I finally understood that. <sighs> Don't worry, it's okay. I'm not planning on dying anymore. Hopefully we don't have to worry about that then. The way who I truly care about to give in now. So I'll fight 
for Dana and for myself. I'll fight against my fate to preserve our future. And I'll win. Come hell or high it. water. I'm excited to see it. I, I want her to I be able to, to but I wonder how they'll but handle it. Let the world end because of me. I don't know how these games go. I don't know if they end doom and gloom or how they handle it. It's going to be a long, yeah, I don't know. hard road ahead, Shion. Our fight won't be over until everyone, both I wonder if, and Renans. If there's multiple endings and I fucking have her, like, die because I don't do all the side, I'll be so fucking pissed off. I can finally live in peace. <laughs> <laughs> you get the worst ending unless you finish that boss that I backed out of. <laughs> it's just me sat there going, ah! But I swear I'll be there with you until the very end. I could see it being Thank like you. Alfin sacrifices himself in her place. Remember what we learned back in Calaglia? I could see that being a thing There's too. There's no wall so high that we can't break it down. Yeah, I think you may be right about that. Okay. That was very lovely. Great screenshot of that, too. Members have returned to the party. And boarding the ship. This is going to be how it all ends. This is surely the point of no return. I am at a not too high level 40. A lot of work to do. I am going to pause this and come back to it later on. Maybe even tonight. We'll see if I have anything else I want to do or not. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm going to stop for the time being at least. Oh boy. A lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. I'm excited to try more. We will uh, have to get that that soon. Part 15. Dunzo. Oh. Here's hoping that I can keep everybody alive. Uh, except for Law. Hope he dies. <laughs> if, if I have the choice, sacrifice him. 